Hey everybody, Lego Doctor here, back with you another video. Today we have not exactly a Lego review, but we are reviewing the 2018 February McDonald's toys representing the Lego Movie 2. Uh, I collected all of them that are available in the US, so let's get started. So here's the first one I collected. It's a Duplo alien, the one uh, seen to the right of Duplo, the uh, little one with the flower on it and the bill looking thing. This one also looks like it has a bill. And it's actually kind of weird because it's kind of off scale, but it's similar to the scale of an actual Duplo brick. It's hard to um, compare. It's got a green tag that says the Lego Movie 2 in it, molded right there with kind of a cheaper plastic, of course. Uh, kind of, uh, these are, are smooth right here, and over here is kind of, um, has a little bit of texture. On the back, there's some pegs, so it can just kind of slightly hover, I guess, with the blue back and the blue eyes, with, uh, these eyes being kind of, like, a really dark blue. Actually, it doesn't show that well on camera, but that's kind of how it looks in person. Um, and this is actually not... That's um, molded with this. And inside, you have a tic-tac-toe game with Emmett and Lucy slash Wild Style. I've added in a special like little pattern right now. But... I suppose I will play a game just to demonstrate. Myself. Okay. So, Emmett. Wrong one. Here we go. Over there and. No one won. Okay. So, yeah. That's that one for this toy. Next up, we have Emmett. He's got his little classic smile with his two dot eyes. He's got kind of a different blue from this one, as you can see on the camera. It's kind of darker, I guess. And one thing that kind of eludes me is this tag is red. I thought it would be orange, considering his outfit, but it's red. Not that I mind it that much, but it's a little odd. Got the little, um, hair pollock, I think it's called, up there. There's only a little scratch right here on mine. And, uh, yeah, same thing on the back with those little dots. I'm just going to show that for this last one, and that's it. Uh, this is put together with them. The hair and the face are molded together. And inside we have a puzzle, so... Okay, let's see. Obviously, since I was looking, in this case, I am pretty easy to put back together. Um, and then, after I collected Emmett, the next one I collected, I got another one of these, because I got a second Happy Meal that day to collect them. Um... Some some of them I bought by them own by their own, and some of them I got a Happy Meal. Um, and I got these two on the same day. I got this one first, which is Wonder Woman, uh, that I traded in a duplicate of this guy for. Um, and inside, she first off she has a kind of a red back uh, with a yellow tag. This it's not exactly gold, but it works. Um, and there's, like, a little scratch on her eyebrow and her lips on mine. And then the black and the flesh tone is molded together. And inside, you have this, uh, Duplo alien, which is supposed to be the same alien as this guy right here. And, um, what you do is right here in this hole, you set him up. He will easily fall down, but you're supposed to throw these onto him. And kept, yep, there he goes. 
or you can just try and throw them in to each one of the holes. So, not a bad toy, to be honest. I thought I would like it a lot less than I did. And he just goes back in there. Perfect. That's just a little sticker, so. Yeah. Falling apart. So yeah, as you saw just there, uh, sometimes the hinges come off relatively easily. Uh, if you want to, or whether or not you want to do or do not want to. Um, here we have Ultra Caddy. And she's got the same uh, appearance. She just doesn't have the little um, horn like this does. Uh, so that's the only inaccuracy, but that would be making it go all the way up here. So that would be very tall. Um, although I guess they did that with her, so with the Unikitty back there. Uh, the red on her back, similar to Emmett and the Duple Alien, is a little bit different. It's harder to see on camera for this one. But it's a little bit different than Wonder Woman. This face is actually a sticker. Uh, and when I say stickers for these, uh, you do not actually put them on. They come on the toy. Um, it's a gray base. And inside, you have some little activities. You have a LEGO Movie 2 pencil. So let's open that up. Oh, this stuff doesn't come off easily. So it's just a tiny little pencil that says Lego Movie 2 on it. And some corporate, corporate stuff. You can put that in there. And then you've got these. One of these papers is just a little bit out of line of the others. Uh, but yeah, we've got a minifigure head. And oops, on both sides, you have them on all of them. The minifigure, Emmett's face, you can Emmett's body, and another minifigure. And you can just, uh, I suppose, you could just kind of compare yours to your friends for this. Like, your friend could draw on this back, this side, and um, you could draw on this side. So, yeah, pretty fun. Oh, and I forgot to mention she has a brown backpack tag. I think a couple day la days later it was, um, my mom was kind enough to drive me around town, and we got three toys, Unikitty, Batman, and they were just changing to the, uh, now Teen Titans theme, Teen Titans Go, that is, and I got this, which they kind of just seem to have backup toys, just in case, um, so I guess we'll look at this first, I got this and Unikitty at the same restaurant. Uh, so for this, it has Lego Ninjago movie on the back, the little camera with a dragon design, looks pretty cool, and there's this little thing, which you can pull down right there, but you're supposed to push this button right here, there's a nice little design right there as well, and some buttons on the side with a speaker, a flash, a camera, I don't know. But you push this, then you pull it down, and inside are stickers of the entire ninja crew, and those will just come out of this package. And just slip those back in, or anything that fits. We've got this selfie right here, where Jay seems to be blinding these two shark guys um, with his flash. And the same face right here, with all of the ninja friends in their normal daily uh, outfits. Then, um... It also came with a couple things. This is what the packaging looks like. Right here, we can play right there. And it came with a couple of coupons, etc. Instructions. And each toy came with a little disc that's collectible. This one is J. And then we have Unikitty. And the printing on this one that I got, it's printing a sticker like Ultra Caddy was. Um, it's really crisp on mine, and there are, appear to be no scuff marks, but there is a downside with this one. It's probably just mine, but it barely clings on to the latch, and when it does, it doesn't hang on for long. Uh, the back is a slightly different pink, 
than the front. And she's got printing to see all the crevices. And this nice little cheery face that came in the Cloud Cuckoo set. And uh, this is more rounded than the Lego one is. But that's for good reason. You don't want children poking their eye out. Uh, and inside, this dropped out just now. Also, white backpack tag. Doesn't show up very well. But inside, we have a matching game. I'm not going to play this one. But we have two... Let's see. Can I get it? Yeah. There we go. We have two Emmets. Two Lucy slash Wild Styles. Two Batman. Two Ultra Caddies. Two General Mayhems. And one Rex. Danger Vest. So, yeah. Not bad. And by the way, all those cards have the same little Lego Movie 2 back to them. For Batman, I think this was a, actually a returned toy. Um... Because the mouth was askew, the sticker on the mouth, so I'm not sure if you can see in the camera. Also, his face looks way more white. It mo looks more like this. Um, but yeah, it was askew, and the bag was open, so I don't know what that's about. He has a yellow tag, and you can't exactly swivel that as well, because he has his ears in the way. And then... You can see this little tab on the side, and we'll get to that in a moment. Um, the back. Inside, there's what looks like a grumpy face. So, I'm not entirely sure um, if the Lego Batman movie used this. I know the original Lego movie didn't, because they had cups. So, maybe that was there from an old toy. Who knows? But inside, we have a maze, and you just supposed to get it from... Uh, Emmett's to Batman, and then there's that card. And on the back side, you can get it from Batman to Unikitty or vice versa. I personally like this one just slightly better, except it does cover up Ultra Caddy's mouth. So, yeah. And this is how it came right here with the this side forward. For the final two... These two were actually mail-ordered for me by my mom, and I can't thank her enough for that to complete my collection and make this video possible. And here we have what's called on the package Wild Style, uh, even though they easily could have used Lucy. Um, it does look like she did in the original movie, uh, so I guess there's that. The streaks are a little thin, which isn't quite as accurate. Uh, just like Wonder Woman, the pupils are the same, uh, tone as the skin. She's got the freckles, she's got a little bit of a smirk. The same face as seen in some of the original Lego movie sets. Kind of a teal-ish blue back. And inside, you kind of have to place this perfectly, I'm just going to say, to be able to fit this in there, but it's a little crossbow. Right there. Um, got this little design right here. And the disc says, Never Stop. That nice little sticker, which is a print in the Lego sets, which is honestly a really awesome piece to get. And um, you just shoot that. Sometimes it doesn't work. It depends how hard you squeeze it. And if you look here... It's actually a little target, so you're supposed to hit this down. Didn't hit it down, but I knocked it over. Also, I didn't note this, but I've been putting it in like this, and it's actually supposed to have this little groove right here, which you're supposed to keep right there. So that makes more sense, and this probably makes it a little bit easier to fit it inside of your toy. Come on. Can't remember how I fit it. There we go. And then we have Sweet Mayhem, which is her unmasked version. Uh, you can't quite tell here. It looks just white in the camera, but her skin is a kind of a pinkish tone. 
with this really greeny, kind of blue, teal thing. Her hair is not, uh, it's, sh it's the same amount of shine as any of the others, um, at least in person, unlike the figure with the chrome-type bubble hair or whatever. Um, yeah, and she's got kind of a kind face, which is similar to, uh, one seen in the sets. A uh, little bit of a scuff right there, but that will probably come out. And kind of a, a more of a teal than this. Um, honestly, this looks more teal on camera than it is in person. It's more of a blue. Like, kind of the same as her hair streak. Um, but back to Sweet Mayhem. Looks like that from the back. Kind of a weird shape right here. And then you can see this poking out. So, inside we have a craft that allows you to build Emmett and Lucy. So, I'm going to build that right now. Um, I'll be back. Okay, I decided to build this in front of you because... I just kind of felt like I should maybe. So I'm just going to build Emmett. I'm not going to just build Emmett, but just going to build Emmett on camera. So, is that all the pieces other than his head? Here's the faces kind of laid out. The bodies are kind of scrunched up right now. And this is probably my favorite toy by the looks of what it had. It even has printing on the back for the legs. So, I'm going to build on it. Let's see. Hold on. Okay, um, this looks a little more complicated. And this would make the video run very, very long. It's already long enough as it is. I've gone into maybe a little too much detail here. Um... And, uh, so I'm just going to build this by myself. Okay, so, uh, this video has just run too long, in my opinion, so I'm just going to do a, a, a retake, so. Take two. Or 